the things out. Let me just walk you through the, the wasteland here. Quite a mess. Good, good morning to you. How you doing? Good morning. Hi. Good. Yeah, we, we, uh, I, uh, I have my truck here. I'm going to help people with some other sure. stuff. Now, uh, people are worried that they're going to get arrested before we can get some of their stuff out. No, here. no, no. No, no arrest? Not. Well, I mean, I, I can't say no arrest because who knows what could happen. Right. We, but no, no, no. What we want to do is let, if, if you want to help people get their stuff out, if as long as people are still moving forward, right. we are good with it. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do. I, I've uh, yep. There's Tom down there, Tom and Jackie, yep. and then uh, Janine. I'm yep. going to help her get some stuff out. So if I can bring my truck in. Yes, without... absolutely. Okay, well, I just I, I want to. You know, no, I, no, no, I know. You know, I no. want to be. We, I wanna, no, we appreciate I want to follow the protocols. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's important. Yeah. Otherwise, it's good. No, right? you are the protocol. Help me out. <laughs> I know. We, we, that's our, our goal is for people to, we're, you know, all along has been for people to get their stuff and to have help and whatever. Yeah, so they're not. So they're going to be ticketed though. You think maybe today too, or it's not if they're as long as if the if, if anything if anybody gets anything, right? It'll be because they just go. I'm not moving, and there's nothing you can do about it, officer. If if people are trying yeah. to leave or trying to get their stuff or waiting for a ride or any of that, then no. We okay. Don't, yeah. No. All right. Okay. And how much time do you think they'll have? Because some of these people, as you know, back there, geez, they've got like, all day, you know, more than all day. If more they than have, all day. Yeah. Okay. As long as they're progressing. All right. Yeah. All right. Okay, no problem. I'm going to go get my truck then. Yeah. All right, thank you. Fantastic. Thanks, guys. Thanks. And if, if you hear, if anyone else says anything like, I, man, I'd like to help, but I don't, just say, yeah, that's okay. All right. And if they want to check with me, that's fine. Or if not, just follow you in. But, all right. Yeah. Good to know. Thank you. Yep. All right. Thank you. Yeah, all right. You're welcome. It's really not his job now at this point, now that the shelters are full. I think we just need to keep working on the solutions of the city and the county. Good morning to you. I'm working to get some of the people out of here, okay, helping great. them get their stuff. And there's some people in here who've got uh, probably a year's worth of stuff. I'm I got a little camera going. I'm I'm uh, I'm with I Care America. It's a nonprofit organization. We're just helping people. I've been working with Batman and Robin for yeah. a All number right. of weeks. So I want to I want to. They said I could bring my truck in. So if you see me coming in, uh, I'm great, on the, on, on the side. Of, um, yeah, I want to help. I want I want it to be a nonviolent solution. I want it to be something that works for everybody. Paul right, Caltrans, they got some good equipment. They make these guys look like they don't know what they're doing. They'll just scrape everything up, haul it down, and dump it or put it in their yard. Well, you know, one of the, I, th I don't think so. I think these people are looking for their friends to help them. There's kind of a camaraderie that happens. If they're not on drugs. These people are wiped out on alcohol and drugs. you got to straighten them up so they know where they're No, I'm not going to straighten them up. These people are my friends, and, and some of them are in trouble. So you mean doing drugs is good no, for them? I haven't been, no, no, I'm not, hey, 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 I didn't say Look, drugs I'm were... I'm not even talking. I'm going drugs. this way, you go that I way. I didn't say drugs were good I'm for right, people. Uh, uh, I'm going you know what? You've got, you're an arrogant person. You're very I'm arrogant, man. You're, you know what? You're an arrogant person. I'm here doing good work with people, well, and you just people did a disservice. And and you and just did a disservice, just so you know. You, because I'm out here helping people. I'm doing something good for people, and here you do run your mouth in an arrogant way. You're making you need your to life too easy for You need to learn about life. Don't go the other way. I'm going the other way because you know what? You're not worth talking to. Hey, officers, did I say I was supporting drugs? Oh, I want to get a reality check here. Did I say that? No. No, I didn't. Hey, did you hear what he just said? Get a life, will you? Go back to your home where you can be in denial about your own life. You arrogant prick. You heard me. I know. You probably smoke a lot of pot. Don't judge me, I don't smoke anything. I don't smoke anything. Get this guy out of here. He's causing trouble. Get that guy out of here. I'll tell you what, one of these guys out here is going to hit him if he keeps doing that. I got no patience for people like that. I care, yes, I care America, and I also care about having people watch what comes out of their mouth.
You see, it's people like that. It's people who have no idea what human dignity is about, what caring about people is about. Just because people, even if people are on drugs and alcohol, it doesn't mean they need to be treated like they're trash. Part of why people are addicted to drugs and alcohol is because other people have treated them like trash in their life. That doesn't absolve them of their own responsibility, but it certainly does point to a bigger problem. And until we all work together to educate people who are stupid and arrogant on both sides, both on the community side and on the people who are, are in the homeless community, there's a lot of ignorance that needs to be educated. And I think we need to do it with compassion, but also I think sometimes we need to kick people in the ass with compassion.